What is going on? I am super pumped today. I am headed down to the velodrome in Carson to do a pre-bike purchase fit. Going to find out which bike models would suit me best based on my body size. Well, that was awesome. I have never felt so good in an aero position. Was limited amount of time, but it felt really good. I'm super excited to see where this goes. I think I'm gonna bring possibly my Trek down. Depending on how long it takes to get a bike, I might bring my Speed Concept down and just let him adjust it so that it feels better. Well, I have just finished a swim workout, which had a ton of big kick sets, which I don't know what it is. You would think with a size 12 foot, I would actually be able to kick across the pool, but kick is one of my weakest parts of swimming. I feel like I go nowhere. Kickboard kicking is just brutal. Halfway across, the lactic acid is building up in the legs. I don't know what it is. I just don't have a good kick. I am all upper body when it comes to swimming, which hey, at least with the triathlon and a thicker wetsuit, that's not as big of a deal, but that is something I would really like to get better at is kick. So I'm gonna have to focus on that. But now I am headed to an early morning appointment with Dr. Andrews. He is a chiropractor, ART uh, specialist, and he is going to hopefully adjust me, figure out what's going on with my back. When I went and had the bike fit, the bike fitter noticed that my legs were actually sitting at different lengths and he felt that I was probably out of adjustment just based on my ankle bone placement and how far apart they were. So we're gonna see what Dr. Andrew says. Well, I didn't get any recording done in the office because basically I was squirming around the table the entire time he was working on me. Started at the toes, worked through the arch, which on both feet was were pretty much locked up, not really flexing at all. Up through the calves, he uh, worked on basically a lot of the muscles being kind of stuck together and uh, just lots of pain when he's pressing on that, making you move your ankle up through the knee, the leg, and then uh, worked on the hips, did some laser on the hips and kind of the heel and Achilles area. So apparently it's not just uh, come in and crack my back and I'm fixed and I'm good to go. Uh, that's what I get for taking a break from coming in and not being on that regular, probably twice a month schedule getting maintenance. I took a huge break from seeing him because I thought I was feeling really good but in reality, I need to be getting that maintenance check in now. I'm paying the price. I will be sore tomorrow. I did have a half hour run later today. Um, I'm gonna see how I feel and make that decision later. Well, I'm done with work. It is Friday evening and a couple things going on tonight. One, hanging some photos. One thing I 
don't do enough of, and I watch Peter McKinnon. He is a YouTuber, video creator, and he always talks about printing your photos, and it's something I need to do more of, so one of my goals is to put up some really nice frames throughout the house, and then change those out regularly with photos that I've shot. I have taken so many pictures last year when I went on the National Parks Tour, I'm gonna put some of those up and they came in. So I'm excited. I've got some of those prints and then I printed this really cool photo that I will put somewhere else of my daughter. It just came out great. So that's gonna go somewhere else. But tonight I'm gonna to put up three photos from Glacier and the Grand Teton. So that's what we're doing. And then I think I'm gonna hit a strength workout just to cap off Friday night. Yeah. Baby said that they don't got a future, future like that. It burns, so give him something worse to kill his head with, make him forget somehow. Might be that another day she would have wished he stayed, but they're done. Sorry, this won't be enough this time. Yeah, he's calling all his friends to get some action and distract him right now. He's fine, but Lucy on the line, let's get this started. Where's the party tonight? That is it. I'm done for the day. Now I need to eat. Let's get some food. It is Saturday morning and I have a two hour easy bike ride. It is foggy outside and early in the morning. It is about 545. So I'm gonna knock this ride out indoors this weekend just because it's Easter weekend. There's a lot going on. I'm actually headed down this afternoon to meet some buddies at uh, his boat. So just gonna knock this out early so I can get on with the day. Well, that was good. It was a nice two hour ride, a little over two hours. I rode about 19.6 or 0.8 miles per hour, just cruising, nice high cadence between 85 and 95. Uh, the course on Zwift was fairly flat. I think only maybe uh, 1800 feet of elevation over the whole two hours. So felt good. Goal was not to burn the legs out. Tomorrow, I've got a long run. We will see. It is Easter tomorrow, so I may just have to hit the, the local tracks or road trail here and knock it out because we've got Easter. We've got an Easter bunny. I'm sure he's bringing baskets. Now, I'm gonna get cleaned up, eat some food, heading down to the coast to a place called the Newport Dunes. Check out my buddy's boat.
I am back from the boat. It was good to hang out with my buddies, but now we are about to do some egg coloring because it's Easter tomorrow. And only in California are the girls in swimsuits and just out of the pool coloring Easter eggs. One more. It is Easter morning. The girls have discovered their baskets, opened all their candy and their toys, and now I am making some pancakes for them, attempting some bunny pancakes. We've eaten all the pancakes. Now, time to hide the eggs. These gold eggs, these are the golden eggs. They always have money in them. Are we ready to hunt eggs? Is that a golden egg? A one? You gotta look at me. One, two, and a half. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. is it for today's mobility workout. It was mainly groin and shoulders, so, which is good. I've got to swim tomorrow. I've got to run this morning. Well, that was 10 miles exactly. Average pace or overall pace with warm up, warm down was 846s. Felt pretty good, feeling a little tightness uh, in my right leg in the hamstring. So I'm gonna make sure I roll that out today. Hanging out for the day, it's gonna be 88 here. Probably just enjoy the weather before back to work tomorrow. 
4 a.m. 4:15 wake up in the pool. So. <sighs> You know how many times I drop those AirPods and they explode on the ground?